little help? At least the rescue's going well. That won't hold them for long.
This is bad. in your faces. <laughs> Relax. It's flying. We're flying. I knew we would do that. We have guests! There's another one! I knew this was going too smoothly. Uh, little help? They're too fast! I think that's the end of Birger. You think he survived that? He's down there picking the dirt out of his nails with the beast's feathers. You'll see. He... Uh, <laughs> he has to be. We're almost there, Ingvi. Just hold on a bit longer. I don't suppose I have much of a choice at the moment. and boiling water. Red root and lamb's crest. I know, I know. You think I never staunch a bleeder before? Oh, now don't you go worrying, boss. I didn't go through any of your stuff while you was off being tortured. Ah, damn it, Linda. Easy. Heck you says to me for? I ain't the one who stuck you like a damn pig. No offense. Freya, mind giving her a hand? We're just taking over entirely? Hold still. She'll just get you stable so I can take you to Sindri's house. The rest of my herbs are there. We'll protect the realm in your absence. The four of us. Vanaheim's in good hands. Party at Sindri's house, then. Whoever that is. Your boat. Nope. Your boat. Come on. Take it. Sail the skies, sun yourself on its bow. You look like you could use it. <laughs> Make a Vanir god proud. He gave you his boat? Nice. He left me no choice. 
Because it was necessary, not because it was written. Prophecy holds that Galahorn is the Herald of Ragnarok. Whatever it does. I read about it in Odin's library. Supposedly it... Hold it, Treyas. We will discuss in private. I'm sorry, love. Beardro is the one who found me wounded in the jungle when I was trying to find my way back here. Watched over me as I slept. I never thanked him. If you want to thank him, don't get captured again. Promise. I promise, love. Find that orb yet? Good to see you again, Kratos. Have you been back now, by any chance? Big Vir. Now is not the time. All oh, right. Nearly forgot about that hidden sign to me mentioned. Heimdall is dead. Good. Is it? Look, I don't know from fate, but I know Heimdall was a prize-winning taint stain with the capital stamp. If he was gonna hurt your boy, it's a good thing he ain't around no more. The Norns didn't quite see it that way. The opinion of them three shut-in spinsters ain't worth a goat fart in a hurricane. You did what you did. No need to fret about it. Before your return, we have to decide whether or not to abandon this camp. What does that mean? Helka smells something. Could be important. Maybe we should follow her. Tracks. Helka's. What do you want to do now? We don't have to go straight home, do we? Ah, we can always try finding Helka some other time. to tell you. I read something in Odin's library about what Galahorn is supposed to do. If blown by a god, it sounds through all the realms and harmonizes the space between them. Blow it somewhere like Tyr's temple, and it would be like opening up all the realm travel towers at once. It's quite a vulnerability. Wonder why he didn't just destroy it. Some artifacts defy destruction. Well, we should make Freya aware of this. <gasps> have you found for me lately? Uh, oh, oh, that's right. <laughs> None! Speak. The tree has become rather... overgrown. And? And, if it grows too wildly, the branches risk getting too heavy and falling, which is not ideal, considering they hold all the rounds. I am no gardener. What an absolute shock. No, I do not require any horticultural skills from you, but I would ask that you keep an eye open for the stags of the Four Seasons. They normally graze upon the tree and keep it tidy. Unfortunately, Bitter decided it would be funny to trick Arrogant into releasing them. If you happen to find the stags during your travels, I would greatly appreciate assistance in bringing them home. I would have one of my spectral squirrels do it, but they, well, keep eating the feed I give them. Consequence of it being the most delicious food in all the Nine Realms, I suppose. Speaking of, here, take some feed. Once you've found a stag, the feed should calm them down. Then one of my spectrals will guide them back here. And, uh, don't eat the feed, please. I will not. Bitterness asked me if I was too chicken to release them. 
but I am in fact not chicken-like whatsoever. So as you can see, I had no choice. Yes, of course. What else could you have done? <sighs> While normally this would be a harmless prank, Fimblewinter prevented the stags from returning, and now they have long since scattered to parts unknown. It was worth it. Now then, any luck finding those lean worms? Seems we met another of your detachable emotional apparitions. Bit too twitchy to tell us his name, though. Ah, you must mean anxiety. Oh, no. Why are you talking about me? What did I do? Oh, you should have heard the shit they were talking. Sad. What? Oh, dear, oh, dear. There was no such talk. Shame on you, Bitter. Are you sure? Yes, Anxious. No opprobrium to be found in this discourse. I was merely making your acquaintance with our adventuring friends here. Ah, people! Well, there it is. Well, stay safe, everyone. <sighs> yes, we'll be moving along to other things now, you hulking dingbat. Do you just like hearing the sound of the chimes? I suppose they do sound very pretty. Master Kratos, this feels very uncharacteristic of you, but if you enjoy the pretty chimes that much, I will allow you to indulge. Yes, you've done it. Well thrown. Are the best. You have always been the best. Hey, tell her she's the best. Oh! You're back, the heroes of the hour. I want to hear everything. I mean, when you're ready, I'm not giving orders here, am I? Try to rest, Ingvi. Let the herbs work. Oh, they work? Oh, they, they work very well, because you make things better. You always have, since, since we were kids. I find a new way to get into trouble. And you find a way to make it better. Well, that's certainly true. Do you know... <clears throat> do you know we used to leave Vanaheim? Together? When we were young? Not much older than you, to be honest. Well, you know, she did the leading. I just... tried to keep things fun. <laughs> Leadership. Not really my strong suit, let's be honest. <laughs> really? Your group back in Vanaheim seems pretty devoted. Well... I can inspire people, I guess. Eh, you get them to see the best in themselves, you know? I don't know if that's leadership. It's more like, um... Like a muse? Wait. Like... like a what? A muse. Father told me about them. In his homeland, they inspired all kinds of artists. What? I love that. That's a job? Well, why don't we have that? Oh, man. I could totally do that. I think they were all goddesses, though. Well, come on. That's not fair. That's not fair. I, I would be a natural. Oh. What were we talking about? Ingvi, you must rest. You understand? You must. Please, just stop talking. Okay, I'm sorry. But someone was gonna fill us in on what happened with Enough. Us. Look at that. <laughs> you really did it. How, in all the nine realms, did you manage to kill Heimdall? I knew our spear would do the trick. Well, happy Ragnarok, everybody. Let's drink. Is it true? Heimdall's dead. I can't believe it. There's no stopping it now. Odin swore peace only so long as you spilled no more Aesir blood. I refused that deal. Yet he honored it. But now... But what? You and I know better than anyone that Odin's promises never last. 
We have the advantage now. It's time to bring him down. No. None of you understand what's coming. Odin's vengeance will be his only concern. Not his only concern. The mask. Whatever knowledge it unlocks, that's what Odin wants more than anything. If I go back to Asgard, go I can't. Use... Go back. Look. If I can finish what I started there, awaken the mask, get answers. Maybe that's our way out of this. But I gotta go soon. Before they figure out what's happened. Choice. You are home. Do not ask me to put you at risk again. He's at risk where he stands, Kratos. We all are. Anything we do or don't do is dangerous right now. But Odin needs me. He trusts me. I'll be safe there. From a tactical perspective. Am I wrong? I don't much like it, but it is our best play. Dividing Odin's focus would buy us time. And give us a pair of eyes in the enemy's inner sanctum. But if there is truly a source of infinite knowledge, you can't let Odin have it. Aye. And once he has what he needs from you, then I lose my leverage. I get it. I'll be smart. Father, I can do this. Remember our promise. You too. You know what you're doing. I do too, Sam. Well, I still want to hear how you did it. You mean how we did it? Ah, you got me. And therein lies a tale. Uh. Trance, listen. I can't let you go back without this. A hammer? Your key, please. You ever need a way out of a bad situation? Throw this down hard and say, Wergi. One use only. Wergi. Thanks, Sindri. Hope I don't need it. Me too. All right. Odin said Hugin would be waiting in the cabin. Mimir, anything else I should know about Odin? Maybe a weakness or something? Like if I flip up his eye patch, he'll disintegrate. Aye, lad. Wouldn't that be? Yeah, no. Sorry, Mimir. I can't do your accent. I'm on my own for this one. <sighs> Here we go. Oh, were you having a moment? It sort of looked like you were having a moment. I can go. No. Sorry. This is Fenrir. <laughs> it's okay, Ben. She's, uh... <laughs> <laughs> so, I was right about your knife. Huh? I'm glad you found a place for his soul. <laughs> me too. Hey, uh, how'd you find me here?
Loki? This is my marble. <laughs> and where are you heading off to? Back to Asgard. Hey, I'm actually using him. Uh-huh. Ingerboda, look. Once I see this through, I'm gonna know everything. How to save my father, how to stop Ragnarok, and maybe, hopefully, how to bring our people back. Loki, those are all very noble intentions. But he's Odin. You have faith in me, right? Of course I do. I just hope the story you're writing for yourself is the one that you truly want. Would you... Would you take care of Fen while I'm away? I'll take good care of him. Won't I, boy? <laughs> Be careful, Loki. Okay. Help Odin complete the mask, but also make sure he doesn't get any answers from it. Easy, right? He's probably in a study. Hmm, huh. nicely equipped. That needs work. Sorry for interrupting. Oh, you're not interrupting anything. Forsetti's investigating, so the truth will come out soon enough. I hope it does. You'd better go. Okay. Panic does nothing. Harness it. Heimdall's dead. Happen to know something about that? Anything? Well, I mean, everyone hated him. Sure, sure. But have you seen anything? Something noteworthy? I mean, you know, he did sock through it pretty hard while we were out. Maybe someone found out? Got even? I, I don't know. Are you suggesting my son had something to do with this? I don't know. Honest. Well, I had to ask. Never believed you had anything to do with this. I'm glad you're back. So, I figured out what went wrong. I mistranslated a word here. Did you now? I thought it said beyond the cry of cold breath, but it actually reads the cry of first breath. Well, that's somewhere else entirely. I know where that is. Young man, you've done it again. Go. Take the mask, take the sword, take the bird, find Thor. We're going to Niflheim. Too. Hey, Ingrid, you wouldn't happen to know where Thor is. Yeah, 
I figured. Uh, hi, Sif. Do you know where I can find Thor? All Father is sending us on another mission. Why would I tell you where to find anyone I cared about? Look, it's fine if you don't like me or trust me or whatever. But I want you to know that you're hurting her. Excuse me? Druid's gonna be a Valkyrie one way or another. You know that. If you don't stand with her, you're gonna lose her. You may be working with Allfather and enjoying his little bubble of protection, but stay out of my family's business. Enjoy your freedom while you still have it. Maybe I should stop by my room. Might be a while before I can fix up my equipment again. Sorry, um, all father said I'm supposed to head to Niflheim with your dad. I haven't seen him around, and I was wondering if you had any idea where he could be. He wasn't with grandfather? No. I think I know where he might be. Follow me. I, uh, also wanted to talk to you about Heimdall. Don't. Not here. You're right. Later. Back in Helheim, I told you I'd help your mom understand how much becoming a Valkyrie meant to you. I wanted to, uh, let you know that I meant it. You didn't. And you're still alive? I did think she was gonna choke me with her hair. I'm honestly surprised she didn't. Thanks, Loki. Weapons aren't allowed inside. We'll have to check them. Why? Just do it. Come on. This way. Oh. Come on. They're not gonna let you in otherwise. Look around. He'll be here. <laughs> Throat. I'm. It's fine. Hey, Thor. Seems like it might be a bad time, so. If you need a moment, I totally understand. No rush, but. Uh... Right where I thought you'd be. You shouldn't be here. You... You shouldn't have brought her here. What are you doing? Relaxing. Did I say no rush? I meant we should get going, right? We don't want to keep the all-father... Quiet! He's right. You should get going. Dad? 
Don't do this. It's already done. Let it be known, the God of Thunder is good for two things. Killing giants and pissing me! Any man who disagrees will greet Mjolnir with its face. I can't. This isn't you. Thor. <clears throat> Hugin is waiting outside. Please, let's just... I said... Quiet, boy. My name is... Uh, what? No, I... Oh, come on. No, 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 I swear that really wasn't... That's enough! Yeah. <laughs> 
you start it again. Right now, just put down the... <sighs> Grab his arms. Let's get him out of here. Is he good fight? <sighs> <sighs> I'm sorry you had to see him like this. No, no, it's fine. Really. Hey, I'm strong, but you gotta help me out here. Come on, it's not that far. Get up. Ah, uh, You are going to Niflheim with Loki. All Father's orders. You have to get up. I know you're disappointed. Disappointed? No, 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 no. That was a glorious fight. You can't even say you're sorry this time, can you? Because what's one more broken promise? <sighs> Grandfather treated you like crap. You were struggling. I get it. But you can't just... We're here for you. Mom and I are here for you. Even when you're here. We love you. You know that. I just thought this was behind us. I fucked. Or something. Fine. Let's make this quick. You in a hurry to get back to Asgard? Just get us to that mask piece. Is it worth it? I don't know what you're talking about. Fine, but I hope you know what seeing you like that did I'm strong, not blind. Where to now? Why can't we just fly over these guys straight to the mat? You think I want to carry you all the time? You're strong! I'm not your pack force. You take this one, kid. Who 
Rude looks up to you. I hope you know that. Don't need a lecture about parenting from you. Just fine with it. Looks like we gotta head through that wall. You wanna... Something I need to do first. Take your time. Now we can go. Right. Have giant son of a powerful god with the possibly high expectations. How could I ever know what that's like? Erbaluta! <laughs> I'm not trying to do anything. I'm just pointing out we're not that different. I got no interest in bonding over shared blood. Another wall of ice. Hmm. Thor, could mm -hmm. you... Okay. I just want to add one more thing. If you can't be yourself, you also might not feel like you can follow your own path. That doesn't sound familiar to you at all. <laughs> Says we can't. from Yvaldi's workshop, right? Far enough. Damn it! Ancient! Again with the griping. Calling out a problem isn't griping. It's healthy. 
bet you're glad I'm helping so much this time around. You're welcome. I will say the sword's doing work over there. You're lucky she's helping, too. Through there, just ahead. This will be fun. Well, I don't think that's where we're supposed to go. So, I said it was fun. It was. What are you going to say when you see them again? Sif and Throod, I mean. If all fathers pleased, it doesn't matter. Look, I don't need you to solve my family problems for me. Just find the mask. Let's get out of here. <sighs> Up this way. Looks like there's a path. There's one pathway coming up. You're enjoying the freedom? Out here without Father, you're looking over your shoulder. I, uh, well, yeah, I guess. It's different from what I'm used to, in a good way. Looks like we gotta get up that cliff. I think we no. Thinking. It's better when I know it's gonna happen. <laughs> Don't bother getting up. 
Thor, I, um, hope everything goes okay when you see Sif and Thud again. Well, hoping, thinking, it's a start. It's here. Gotcha. Phew. That was close. Um, thanks, Thor. Wasn't about to lose that. Loki, you did it. We are on the verge of great things, all of our work together. You're welcome. I'm sorry. You are here. Why? His father murdered Heimdall. For said he has proof. Take him. No. Leave him alone. I command it. You said no more Aesir blood would be spilled. You said family comes first. You don't think that this is retribution for him being here? He's put your granddaughter in danger. He's made your son miserable. Loki didn't kill Heimdall. His father did. Your daughter is old enough to make her own mistakes. And your husband started drinking again all on his own. Dismissed! You two, a word. Can't you see what's happening? He's not protecting us. Magni, Modi, our boys. We used to tell them stories by the fire. Do you remember? We would carve those wooden horses. We would play and laugh until the sun sank and they fell asleep in our laps. They were thrown at the All Father's problems like brittle knives to a mountain face. And for what? What if Thrut's next? My father against me, my daughter. I have no idea what's happening. You know, I finally thought of something I can teach you. Hey, stand down! Sentry better be right. Where do you go? Sentry, you sure know how to plan an exit. Atreus. <sighs> Glad you're safe, lad. Got out just in time. Pretty sure I burned my bridges in Asgard, though. Wait, why were you out here? Sindri told us where you would arrive should you find trouble. Oh, thought you might have been exploring without me. No, lad. Your dad was just concerned. Though, now that you mention it... Mimir. Brother, please. It's all so crowded and tense back home. Don't you miss the three of us out finding our own adventures? Putting off the inevitable. Exactly. It's not the worst idea. 
I do want to show everyone the mask, but it'll keep. Have you had a chance to look for the missing stags, my friend? Well then, so what else? So were you always a freakishly large immortal squirrel, or...? <laughs> Don't forget handsome. No, I was once a regular squirrel. The same size as these wispy, spectral versions of myself, in fact. I was unremarkable. I stumbled upon the tree near what should have been the end of my life. The victim of a random act of predatory savagery. But the tree... It had other plans for an insignificant creature like me. But I have prattled on for far too long. I will leave you be, Master Kratos. Journey forth in health and safety, my friends. I'm back, everybody. Hey, hey. You made it. I'll get to here. Join us at the table if you're ready to stay. Oh, see? I told you the key would get him home. Because you tapped it with a hammer. Dwarven magic makes no sense. Right? Lunda one time made me a breastplate out of dog barks. You're back. I still can't figure that Are one you out. You okay? I'm fine. I just hope unlocking this thing was worth the cost. You have it. What did it show you? I didn't get to use it. They found out about Heimdall. I had to run. But at least Odin can't use it either. But... If you didn't get any answers from the mask, all you've done is steal Odin's greatest treasure. Just after your father's killed his most loyal ally. None of us are safe. Even here. So we have no choice. We find Surtur, sound Galahorn, and bring Odin to justice. Now. You'd incinerate every soul in Asgard and call it self-defense? Does he ever suggest plans or just crap on everyone else's? The obvious plan is staring you in the face. We don't need Odin to use this. We can slip into Asgard and do it ourselves, right under his nose. We gain the knowledge we need to shatter this prophecy of war once and for all. Except begging your pardon, you don't have a way into Asgard. They got the big horn, don't they? Oh, so you expect them to sneak into Asgard, blowing a horn that sounds across all the realms? I expect you to bite my blue butt cheek. Please. Just think about it. Oh, don't look at me to come mastermind your schemes. But I'll listen soon as you got what you need here. <laughs> <laughs> 